Look at the drifting on it. Like, oh, okay, the cops are after us. This thing isn't very fast on the road here. Oh, they do go over the dam. Oh, no, I just got ran over. No, 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 no. Don't flip, don't flip, don't. Oh, geez, we caught on the road and flipped. So here we are once again in the update in Beam and G Drive. And today we're going to be checking out some more of the cars that we didn't quite cover in our last episode. Now you are going to notice we are in West Coast, USA. And that's because I never noticed this was here. This definitely was not here. This is a rock quarry. Uh, it's by one of the highways, kind of by one of the watchtowers we used for uh, some of the police escape. And I was uh, looking through the maps. I was like, am I going crazy? This was totally not here. By the way, there's actually missions here too. Uh, but yeah, I thought I'd go ahead and point that out because I didn't see it in the patch notes. Now, not to say it wasn't there, but still. Also, check this out. This is the Autobella Stambeco, which we did check out the rally version of this, but there's a fire truck. I didn't know this was something that we needed. Actually, I would love to see a standard fire truck in this game. Uh, by the way, if you guys have a dream vehicle in Beam and G Drive, not a modded one, but one that the devs put in or a style of vehicle, what would it be? And comment down below. Let me know. I'd like to see some of your guys' opinions. So yeah, I really need that they added that. Of course, West Coast also should have the, uh, the gas stations uh, enabled on it too, so uh, you can go get gas when you're running out. Uh, but yeah, I figured let's go ahead and try this vehicle. There is a police variant of this. I think it's more like a paddy wagon, uh, like a prisoner transport. I would like to see how tough this thing is against the, uh, I guess we'll call it the normal police. Uh, by the way, I love this little fire truck. Not very fast, but I mean, it's glorious looking. I can only imagine when people are going to mod this and it's going to have some sort of like monster engine in it. Uh, I'm actually looking really forward to that. I, I can't put NOS in this thing, can I? I feel like there's got to be a way to get some more ponies out of this thing. Let me go ahead and upgrade the engine. I feel like it definitely needs to be faster. There we go. We've upgraded it some now. Oh, there we go. It's got a little bit better pickup. I mean, it's not like tremendously fast, but definitely would get to the scene a little quicker than it the, uh, the stock version of it. Now, I'm kind of curious. Can we use this thing as a battering ram? So I'm going to set this up pretty simple. Wait, will the police actually chase me in this thing? Uh, oh, it says they're... Okay, they are chasing me. <laughs> Here we go. So yeah, we must make it to the docks in order to escape in this thing. Also, uh, we will pull out the paddy wagon version of this too because it's kind of cute. I mean, this is just like one of those vehicles you want one in real life. I don't know what I would do with it, but it's glorious. Also... We're finally booking it. I mean, booking it is 80 miles an hour on the uh, highway, but still, uh, we got something going for us. Also, uh, move out the way. I like how the uh, AI traffic's getting out of the way too, because we have the sirens on, but the police are definitely not happy with what we're doing. On, uh, shall we run into one? Oh, 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 oh yes. Oh, uh, on, pull off. Are we stuck? Okay, we're not stuck to it. Wow, that barely even made a ding in the front end of this. Okay. Uh, this thing is definitely tough as nails. Yeah, I think the cops are catching the back of us here. All right, we need to take the exit ramp. Uh, actually, no, we can go maybe across the highway here. Watch out. Also, I love the lighting effects on the, uh, the police lights now, how they uh, kind of reflect off the ground. It just looks a whole lot different uh, since the update. I think it's something to do with the bloom. Uh, it is glorious looking though. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and say this is a stolen fire truck. I mean, I don't know who would steal something like this. I guess you could use this in like a forest fire or something, which would make sense for the area. I was about to say, maybe we stole it from a junkyard, but no, maybe this thing would be in service. Uh-oh, uh-oh, okay, the brakes aren't the greatest on this one. Uh, they're trying to block off the way, Han. Let's slide it. Ugh. Okay, it wasn't much of a slide. Oh, that was a flimsy roadblock there. Uh, not even a chance. Also, there's so many different, like, cop cars here. A lot of variation. Watch out. We gotta run over another one here. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, they kind of go under the bumper a bit, but they don't get caught like I thought they would. I thought maybe this was going to be a very bad vehicle for uh, police escape. And hold on. Hit the van. Oh, take it out. That is sweet looking. Okay, the cops are really, really angry at us. Just going to blow through the red light here. We're almost to our escape point. Uh, it's got a whip around here. That is the most ineffective roadblock ever. Boom! There we go. Uh-oh. Uh, I don't know about a head-on-head -head collision. Maybe Might not want to try that one yet. Uh, we're almost to the dock here. Uh, this thing is actually unstoppable. Like, this might be the police car killer. <laughs> Even though it's not very fast. Okay, here we go. Pulling up to the dock. I would say that is a very successful escape. Go ahead and whip it around here. Very, very nice. Actually, we're the... Hold on. Is this new? 
Yo, these docks were not open last time. So they've opened these buildings up. See, it's really nice that like, even though we have a brand new shiny map that the devs have gone back in and done some uh, like touching up here on some of the other stuff. I'm almost curious if we missed anything else. Like I'm kind of looking around where all these dealerships here. I know the main dealership, the Rick's uh, Rich Motor. Oh, it's Rick? No, Rich Motor. Okay, yeah, that was there. Was the uh, was this dealership there? I'm not really sure. I don't want to say for like a lot of this being like, oh yeah, that's new, that's new. But definitely the interior on the warehouses is new and the uh, quarry is new too. So shall we try some police escape with other vehicles? Real quick, I have to pull this out. There's actually two I really want to pull out. Check this one out. This is the Campo, which is just probably one of the cutest little campers I've ever seen. I mean... I guess you could sleep here in the back. Oh, it's just a really nice looking vehicle, Hans. Open the door. Uh, I love the way these doors open. Can we open the other one? That's a door, is it not? Yeah, it's definitely, no, maybe that's just a panel. i open that door. Yeah, maybe that is just a panel for sure. Uh, but yeah, this is really cool. I love the interiors on these. Uh, the rally version has it to where you can uh, inflate and deflate the, uh, the tires, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, let's grab maybe the police version. By the way, what does that actually say? I'm assuming that has to do with something with the police. But yeah, you've got the cage back here. This one's really neat too. I'm assuming this one's basically a tank. This one feels like it's got decent pickup. Uh, it's got a little bit beefier tires. We can still, boom, run into the cops there. Uh, but I don't think we can make them angry in this one because obviously it's a police car now we probably could chase around some suspects in this thing so another thing i wanted to give a little bit of love here before we switch maps is the sts stadium this is the dune kicker uh this would be more like your uh stadium trucks probably would actually see some of this on like a mixture of asphalt and uh some dirt kind of like uh i think it's like the robbie gordon's uh, stadium truck series uh they'll run it like a lot of street courses and they'll have some like makeshift ramps uh, but yeah, this thing, look at the drifting on it. Like, oh, okay, the cops are after us. I guess we're doing a round of, well, that wasn't a very good round of police escape. I'm gonna say our escape point's the quarry here since it's the new item. And you know what? We're gonna line up here. Let's bomb through the city in this thing and see what it's got. By the way, that is the uh, interior. I didn't show that off last episode. All right, here we go. By the way, we gotta go find a mud pit for, uh, the Hydra, uh, that thing, or the Wydra. I don't know why I say the Hydra. Oh, I just spun this thing out. Uh, this is fun. Like, it is surprisingly fun on the asphalt. Yeah, this thing is a ton of fun. I know I initially, when I talked about it, I was like, oh, it's just kind of like the pre-runner. But once you kind of compare the, the two, this one definitely handles a little bit different. I would say this one's actually a little bit funner. Uh, also, that exhaust setup in the back is kind of ridiculous looking. Oh yeah, this goes up here with these and okay, just ripped the panel off. That's good, it just clipped that off. Uh, the body, the wheels, everything's uh, still intact here. Okay, we're gonna go up this hill. Uh, we'll take a left, uh, not at this intersection, but the next one, and then we'll bomb down and hopefully shoot across to the quarry. Oh buddy, the sliding and it's fun. Okay, I might have slid a little too much there. Definitely once we get multiplayer up and running again, we're gonna have to do some racing with a lot of these vehicles because these are perfect and we'll definitely have to probably do it in the, the Johnson Valley map. Even though I'm having a, a real, real fun time sliding this across the asphalt, this is perfect. <laughs> up, 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 that cop tried to turn into us there. Okay, we're good. Okay, we gotta shoot across. It's not this watchtower or I don't know why I say watchtower. A radio tower, it's the one across. Oh my goodness, there's a lot of cops at this intersection. All right, go through here. Uh, they're trying to figure out how to stop me. Let's just take a left here. Oh, get a little slidey boy action. Go right over the curbs though. Uh, not gonna cause us any issues. Dude, the AI traffic's just confused. There's so many cops in the area. They're all just stopped trying to figure out what's going on. Uh, this is cool. Okay, here we go, sliding around. Up, oh, up, oh, I think we're getting, we're not exactly close, but we kind of are. I think if we shoot down this road, this should take us. Oh, no, 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 no. Spinning around that panel hanging off is kind of bugging me. Uh, this thing can be really good at burnouts. All right. Uh, let's head straight down. I think this is the road where the quarry's on. Watch out. No, don't clog this up. Don't clog it up. Uh, got to run through a car here. Uh, let's try not to blow out a tire on the rocks. Uh, quarry, I think, is just up ahead. Oh, the cops are blocking the area. Hold on. Just. Hop off here, there we go, nice. Yeah, I could've swore the quarry's over here. Maybe it's the next, oh, I think it's right there. Uh, how do we get over to it? I need to jump the road somehow, hold on, we can go up. 
up and over, right? Oh, oh, okay. Get through here. Very, very nice. The cops cannot stop us in these new vehicles. Okay, hop over to this side. Oh, jeez. Okay, there's the quarry entrance. I did it again. I keep looping this thing. Uh, you really have to feather the throttle. Uh, you gotta be really, really careful. Hey, at least we ripped off the one thing. Uh oh, something broken. Uh, I think something's bro Oh, no. Come on. Go, 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 go. For the cops, come around. I think something's broken on one of the tires. Okay, and... That is a successful quarry escape. And we're just gonna drive up here. Why don't we just drive it off the top of the quarry? Uh, this would be a fun vehicle uh, doing a little setup race through here. Okay, just throw it sideways. Uh, yeah, there's something broken in my right front. It is like collapsed. It's not even moving half the time. It just, is it cause it's like against the body that it stops rolling? I think there's just something bent in there. By the way, we have successfully evaded the police according to the game. But we're going to successfully drive it off the side of the quarry here and go, wee! Uh oh, this is going to hurt. Oh! That wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. But yeah, uh, it is nice seeing some updates to this map, but we got to do some more vehicle testing, so I think we're going to need a different map for this. So I was looking for some mud to play in in the new Wydra, and I figured let's take it to Jungle Rock Island. I think there's a couple little muddy areas here. Uh, it might not be enough mud. Like, we might need to go find more. Uh, by the way, these things float. I didn't know if you guys knew that. I know I had people telling me in the last video. I was like, yeah, they float, but Johnson Valley doesn't really have many water holes in it. So it's kind of hard to test the thing out whenever, uh, yeah, you don't really have any good areas for it. Look at this. This is cool. Oh, uh, let's go this way. I'm pretty sure all versions of this thing float. Uh, this one's just got the really huge tires, so it seems to float a little higher than the other ones. It's a little silly looking. Oh, and is there a better mud hole here? Like, I need a giant mud map. You know, while looking for a mud hole, I realized that you have, like, the dam here and stuff. Like, we could just drive off this. This might actually be a really good vehicle for escaping the police. Like, you could go where the police can't go. Also, I mean, like, I don't think... Well, you could fit a car here. I don't know if the AI is smart enough to go on this little thing. But watch. We could just go right off into this, and then we'll turn down, and then we'll go... Uh, the river is flowing. Do we actually go with it no can we go against the current here oh this thing doesn't go really fast in the water and it is flowing in the opposite direction but we are making progress that is the thing i don't think we can make it down the waterfall there but yeah it's so odd having a default vehicle that can do this uh, i actually kind of like it oh buddy okay uh, <laughs> i've been going for a couple minutes and i haven't made it very far we're uh, definitely fighting the current here was there a way to drive off the waterfall? No, I don't think you can. I wish there was a path down there to take that. Uh, I don't know if we could fit through this, but we can go all the way down river. Like you get to explore Beam and G maps kind of like you haven't been able to. I mean, there's been, of course, boat mods and everything else, but, uh, and also there's been an amphibious craft mod, but just for a new, oh my goodness, it is not good. <laughs> But yeah, for a new player that just wants to jump in with just the default game, being able to have something like this and like they do what we're doing now, I think this is definitely going to work a lot better while we're going with the water. Oh yeah, this is definitely cruising a little bit faster. But yeah, being able to go down this is pretty incredible. Plus, if you need the perfect way to escape, like going on the river unless... Wait, why is there not a police variant of this? That would be hilarious to watch the AI try to chase you through the water. Uh, I kind of think that'd be a thing. There's a rescue one, which is like a little red one. Uh, I kind of wish there was a police one. Maybe somebody will mod that in. Oh my goodness, that looks like a really good path over there. Oh, and we got to fight the car. Okay, you know what? We're just going to do this. Uh, yeah, there's definitely a lot of places in this map I have not been. And it's been because of just the lack of like uh, vehicles to get there. Like This is not a wide path up here. Also, I think I spawned on top of a rock. These tires are really big. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, you're not taking a full-size car through here. At least it's not gonna be very clean. And look at this. You really get to appreciate like the foliage and stuff through here. And oh, this goes out to the main road. Nice. You know what? I feel like we gotta do it. I love this vehicle. Let's go ahead and see if we can run from the police. I wanna see how they react, especially when we go in the water. All right, I don't know if I can go fast enough to tick off the cops here. I think I could boop into one, but. <laughs> This thing isn't very fast on the road here. Oh, they do go over the dam. Oh, no, I just got ran over. Was that? What? So that suspect was running from the cops and they ran me over there. Well, that was just rude. I don't think we can do police escape in this thing. Hold on. 
Let's run into this cop. I. Oh my goodness, the police are pursuing. Well, good luck with that. <laughs> uh oh, I'm upside down. Oh, and what are they gonna do here? Is he gonna turn off and drive? Wait, can I escape doing this? I mean, I'm upside down. Is the cabin? I would assume the cabin on this is sealed, right? Since you can go in the water. Uh, we're floating down river. Uh -huh, I'm waiting for it to give us that we've escaped. They can't do anything here unless they arrive at the paths down the river. Like they're completely, I mean, I'm kind of screwed right now. Uh, we're just gonna float down river, maybe eventually wash up on shore. There's a path over here to the right. I don't see any cops running down it. They're all just stuck on the bridge over there. Well, that was not the way I was hoping to escape, but that is definitely a means of escape. Uh, float down river. The cops can't get you. Okay, so we're back on Johnson Valley. I wanted to pull out the auto bellow once again. We gave this some love last episode, but I mean, this is just too good not to go check it out. Do a little bit of an escape in it. So I'm going to do this one different. I'm not going to spawn in the default police. I have trucks set up all through the dunes here. And our objective is to bomb all the way across them. And I believe there is actually a lead out here. I think it leads to one of the main roads. I'm still learning the map. I think if you go that way, there's a uh, gas station over there. And if we can escape to one of the gas stations, I would say that is a success. So also, why don't we spice it up a little bit? Let's uh, change the environment. I figured out that the like the sunrise and sunsets are absolutely beautiful on this map. There we go. We got the sun at our back there. We're ready to go. Uh, let's hope we can outrun these trucks. Three, two, one, and let's book it. Oh my goodness. Uh, look behind it. Oh, those things are fast. <laughs> Okay, we might have to do use a little bit of uh, maneuvering here. Maybe uh, uh, get in and... Oh my goodness, there's trucks ahead of us. Okay, go this way. All right, we're going to have to bomb across. They should go straight across after us, I believe. Okay, oh, I'm already turned around. I'm still new to the map, trying to learn it. I feel like we need to go that direction. Oh, look behind us. Where are the... Uh-oh. Oh, no, I see... Oh, yeah, there's trucks coming. Okay, we got to go. All right, let's cut across here. Try not to flip. Got to pay attention to what we're doing. Oh, I see a point. Oh, there's trucks up here. I don't remember spawning trucks up here. Okay, well, apparently I've spawned in trucks ahead of us, too. Okay, just go across this way. Uh, okay, they're turning around. Oh, my goodness. All right, let's use the paths. I know the paths are going to take us uh, in the direction, hopefully, that we want to go here. Uh, I hope it's the gas station. I believe it is. Probably should have used one of the mountains as, like, a reference point. Uh, am I good? Oh, look behind us. Uh, oh, no, I see trucks back there. I caught a glimpse of one. You know, I must say, I actually think this Auto Bella is as fast as those Dune Kickers. Yeah, I definitely think that's a thing. Okay, um, I'm just heading across now. I don't even know where I'm going. This map is just so wide open. I love the map. Uh, very, very nice dunes here. Where, uh, did something just break? I feel like something squatted down on the car now. Uh-oh. Okay, let's get a look behind us. Uh, no, I see... Man, the AI's doing a good job. Uh, they're keeping me on my uh, heels here. I see dust trails all back there from all the trucks. I think we have gotten out ahead of them, which is good. All right, I need to find... Oh, my goodness. Okay, I almost flipped there. Need to find another trail. Something's broken in my left front, I think. Yeah, it's all, like, jacked up. It's not even touching the ground. It's just bouncing. Uh, okay, that's not good. See, that's what happens when you go off trail and try to bomb across it. Uh, definitely not the greatest idea. <gasps> Wait, that's the... Oh, I didn't realize I was going to end up over here. Okay, so this is like the uh, the race starts over here. I don't think the AI can make it through this. Like, I feel like even though we've destroyed our vehicle, I think we've taken a path that they cannot master. I say that. I think I just caught a glimpse. Am I on the track? I'm on the track. All right, go off this way. I'm trying to see if they're behind. Oh, yeah, they're definitely still behind us. I see a truck bombing over the hill back there. Okay, we're getting close to the road. If we get to the road, I think it's game over. We'll be able to light it up, go down it, and get to the gas station. But, man, they kept me on my heels here. I'm actually really impressed with the AI on this map and being able to... Oh, no! No, 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 no. Okay, we've landed. Okay, go, 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 go. I see at least... Okay, there's at least two or three trucks behind us right now. Uh, we're just out ahead. I mean, I still feel like we're going to make this, but uh, it's going to be a little closer than I expected. Okay. No, 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 no. Don't flip. Don't flip. Don't. F oh, geez. We caught on the road and flipped. Okay. Uh-oh. I need to tip this thing. Okay. We're going to have to get out and tip it. Oh, don't. Don't fry the engine. Okay. Come on. Come on. There it goes. All right. So we got it. Tip back up. Oh, my goodness. Turn. Turn. It is so broken. Go, 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 go. Okay. Look, bud. Okay. There's at least one truck that just came out. Uh... 
If we can just go down this road straight, we'll be fine. I'm looking for other dust trails. There's other dust trails out in the desert. They're still trying to track us down. I, I think some of the AI's taking uh, some of the paths. They don't always just shoot straight across. Uh, look behind us, we're topped up. Oh yeah, we got away from them. Nice, and here is the gas station. Uh, we're just gonna launch right in. Oh, 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 hit the brakes, brakes, handbrake, handbrake. <laughs> oh geez, oh, there we go. Well, I didn't expect to die on the curb. How many uh, AI actually make it here is the question. Uh, hold on, let's go down the road. Okay, here comes one. Uh, by the way, I spawned in about 20 trucks. So that's one there. We got another one over here. Two, three. The third truck that just exited. Uh, oh, are they taking different paths? They all die. Oh, here's number four. I see a fifth truck flipped over here. I think we lost a lot of the trucks through all the dunes and stuff. They probably were just like flipping like crazy. Hold on, let's go across. Oh, they're still like booking it through the desert. They're just taking alternate paths to get to me. Uh, there is quite a few that are destroyed, but that's relatively impressive. Uh, I like how they navigate this map. 